According to data from the World Health Organization, 90% of people in the world breathe polluted air. In this context, it should be mentioned that 4.2 million people die each year due to air pollution. The main causes of poor air quality are anthropogenic emissions of pollutants released to the atmosphere. However, meteorological conditions also have an impact on the particulate matter concentration of an inhabited area. During normal conditions, pollution is diffusing over the whole atmosphere as a result of natural convection. Formation of an inversion layer causes a lack of vertical movement of the atmosphere and an occurrence of high and long-lasting pollution concentrations. There is no complex solution to purify the air during the period when the particulate matter concentration in the atmosphere is dangerously exceeded. Recent innovation based on capturing particle matter with specific filters or chemical and biological reactors, but only affects on a small area. These solutions are inefficient in large scale. Uh, the impact of our method is significantly different and seems to be comprehensive solution in purification air on a relatively large area. The operation of the invention can have an impact on the smog layer and restore natural convection in the atmosphere, leading to the purification of air on the ground level. Furthermore, the operation of our invention is interventional. This means it is activated when smog occurs or, as a preventative measure, it is activated during the formation of smog. The invention consists of a shock generator, which creates a cycle of shock waves by exploding a mixture of combustible gases and air. When the detonation chamber is filled up with acetylene, the ignition is induced, which causes an explosion the strength of one megapascal. The created shock wave is directed through a funnel-shaped barrel towards the inversion layer. The result of the shockwave impact is the destruction of the atmospheric temperature inversion layer, which enables the formation of vertical movements of the atmosphere, leading to a reduced concentration of air pollution. Additionally, it consists of an air quality monitoring system, including a contamination detection system mounted on drones and an operational algorithm that determines the parameters of the generated shockwaves, such as the number, strength, and frequency of the explosions, or the total duration of the cycle. Moreover, the invention is fully mobile, which enables a sequential operation over a large area. Let us show the obtained effect on a conducted test. On the 8th of December, 2019, the average concentration of suspended dust in the outskirts of Krakow was exceeding the limit. After arriving at the site and taking measurements, the average dust concentration was obtained at a height of up to 100 meters and was equal to 62 and even 80 micrograms per cubic meter at ground level. We found an inversion layer at the height of 50 to 95 meters. The conditions were favorable for the deposition of particulate matter. We then turned on the shockwave generator, which produced 110 explosions for 10 minutes. The initial results of the device operation show an average reduction of PM10 concentration by nearly 20% in the atmosphere layer at a height of 100 meters at a distance of 10 meters from the axis of the shock waves generation. Obtaining results in the experiment inspire us that our method could have crucial impact of, on interventional purification of large area that is affected by catastrophic air pollution. Let's start fight against the smog. Thank you for your attention. <laughs>